Shh, toothpaste? How is any of this related to making a midday treat? What do you want from me? If it was on the list, I got it. Now let's hurry up and carry all of this back to the manor. It's over toward Junk Street. This shop sells all kinds of odds and ends, shall we? would care to try something on? Oh, young miss. Hmm, did you just get here? That's suspicious. But not to worry, we did all of your shopping for you. Oh, my. Thank you very much, mistress. Key word is we, so you can be pretty confident everything is right. <laughs> I could have done something like this on my own, you know. Such spirit. It's wonderful to see. Spirit? Aha! Uh -huh. You planned this, didn't you? Oh, no. Nothing of the sort. I simply dropped my to-do list in my haste. After which point, you and the young miss were kind enough to take it upon yourselves to aid me in my duties. And surely it was nothing more than kindness on your parts. Oh, my. No, I totally get it now. This whole trip was a ruse to teach Ko a lesson in homemaking. Please keep your voice down. One step at a time, I always say. Hey! What are you two talking about? <laughs> about you, young miss, of course. Take a break. Shall we stop over at the item shop for a spell? A delusion scape. Shall we enter? Pardon me, Master Asahi. Would it be all right if we stopped in here? At Tonoden? I've been thinking of replacing some of our household's electrical appliances. Why would you do that? Nothing in the house is broken right now, is it? You might not be aware, Mistress, but the washing machine and other appliances have begun to show their age. The toaster is also beyond redemption, and has been causing innumerable inconveniences come breakfast time. As such, I've been thinking it would be prudent to replace them without delay. Hmm. All right. Just do it quickly. Oh my! That should do it. And everything is set to be shipped directly to the manor. What's the deal, though, with that washing machine? You could have bought a much bigger one. Smaller capacity models are much easier to use for the amount of laundry we generate, and clean better as well. Well, if you say so, I trust you. Oh, thank you very much. Rest assured, this one is so simple, even you should have no trouble with it, mistress. Huh? Ah, yes, I almost forgot. Master Asahi, I'm sorry to be a bother, but might we make one more stop? Oh, no problem. Then let us make for Juan Quixote on Main Street. Thank 
you for accompanying me. I'll be right out. Oh, we'll give you a hand, Yoshino. Come on, Ko. Hey, Yoshino. What are you planning to buy here, anyway? Just some everyday necessities. I thought perhaps we should use this opportunity to restock the manor. That's awfully pragmatic of you. I'll wait here. Uh, Ko? It's all right, Master Asahi. This is my responsibility, after all. Ugh, took you long enough. I admit we purchased a bit more than expected. Why? We don't need all that. This isn't like you, Yoshino. I do feel like we went a bit overboard. Toilet paper, trash bags, laundry detergent. We bought everything. Oh, my. Well, it's rare that I'm able to come this far into town. In that case, are there any other stores you want to hit up while we have the chance? Perhaps... A bookstore? There's a specific book I've been meaning to purchase. What kind of book? Mm, just a cookbook. A cookbook, huh? The best selection for that would probably be Etri by the station's electric town exit. Shall we? This store simply has too very to stock. I can't decide what to buy. You go on ahead. We've got way too many bags to squeeze through the aisles with, so I'll keep an eye on them out here. I'm very sorry for the trouble, but I will take you up on your kind offer. I'll wait here too. As you wish. Please look after the mistress as well, Master Asahi, if you would. So, hey Ko, did I detect a certain degree of tension between you two earlier? Not from me. You'd have to ask Yoshino what she's thinking. What she's thinking? We'd have been fine not buying anything right now. But I swear, you two bought up the whole store. It doesn't make sense. Ko? My apologies for keeping the two of you waiting. Did you get your cookbook? I did indeed, mistress. The perfect one. Let me have a look at that. Uh, mistress? What? Why would you need a beginner's cookbook? Huh? Is it so strange, mistress? One should never forget the essentials, after all. I was simply hoping to make my cooking as delicious as possible for you. <laughs> I'm not buying it. I swear I'll never understand that girl. Between the two of you, she's clearly the one acting weird. Acting... weird, you say? Oh, uh, see... Ah, uh, I understand. So that's how the young miss has been perceiving all this? Yeah, which is why I said she's the one who's been acting weird. I just don't get what has her so high-strung. Perhaps she's become more aware, which would mean... Yoshino? My apologies. I'm simply musing to myself. But truth be told, I quite like the conclusions I'm reaching. That the mistress could become aware of even the most trifling change in my behavior is simply remarkable. Well, it stands to reason, right? You two have been together for an awfully long time. I'm sure the two of you are so used to one another's mannerisms it'd be hard to miss any changes in behavior. It is true that we've been together for a great while, and she has reached an age that heralds enhanced empathy. Yet while the two of us have always seen the same world, it has invariably been from very different perspectives. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. Simply that I see the world as a maid, and she is my mistress. Nothing more, nothing less. I am a maid, and I live to serve my mistress.